Yo, welcome on in, welcome to the channel. My name is Phil. In today's video, I'm gonna give you the PS5 experience on your iPad. Let's get into it. I'll be showing you how to connect your PS5 controller to the iPad. All you need is your PS5 controller, handy, and all you need to do is get yourself into the settings onto the iPad. So all you do is click settings, and once you're in the settings, you scroll down to Bluetooth on the left hand side. Make sure the Bluetooth is on once you're in the Bluetooth menu. Grab your PS5 controller, you'll see the home button and then you see the share screen button. All you need to do is press them the same time. And once the blue light starts flashing on the control pad, a device to pair to. So once that's pairing, you go back to the iPad and on the iPad, it will search for other devices pops up, you select the DualSense wireless controller, click onto it, once it's clicked, the control pad will be connected. Once the orange light is on the PS5 controller, it will show you that PS5 is fully paired. You will have the PS5 experience now. So the PS5 is fully functional working with the iPad. I could jump, I could use my swords, I could do anything with the PS5 and the iPad is working smooth. There we go. You can play majority of the games on the iPad with the PS5 controller. Next fun fact, even if your battery was dying, the controller was running out of battery, you could use the iPad wire or any USB type C wires, plug them into the slot right in here, come round to the iPad, slot it right in on the iPad. Once that's all plugged in, you should have a charging controller. So I'll show you here. So if you just come out of the app, there we go. A charging controller. There we have it. Thank you very much. I hope this video helped you out a lot. Controllers, it's not only the PS5 controller, it's also the Xbox controller. But if it has helped you out, remember to like and subscribe, drop a comment. I'll catch you in the next video.